Hello everyone, Timer over here. Welcome back to another episode of Stellaris. Um, when we last left off, we had begun um, colonizing Septum here, Septrum. I think that's how you say that. Uh, Septrum the second here, which is going to take a little bit of time. Although we did, we should be okay because we, well, okay. We should go a little faster because we did pick up the expansion perk which does give uh, colony development speed plus 100%. So that should be a little bit quicker um, to develop than normal, which is just fantastic. Meanwhile, back on Timetron here, which is our home world, we are... Did we ever finish this guy yet? No, almost. He is getting there. He's getting there. Um, it looks like we did start constructing a network, mining network there, so that's good enough. I am surprised we have not found anybody yet. Like, no no neighbors or something, so that is going to be interesting. I'm wondering if we, like, jumping over here, I don't know if we can actually reach there with our current... Construction complete. That's interesting. I don't think a wormhole can get over there. I should build a wormhole station in this sector right here and um, and see if that actually would allow me to do that. Oh no, it, it would be fine. I think we'll be all right. Look at how big that is, just this center one here. We should be all right. Uh, our colony ship has successfully followed its program path and made Planetfall and Septum Prime. Thousands of work units uh, have emerged Thousands of work units have emerged from the vessel's massive cargo base to construct an initial deployment post. Uh, efforts to systematically catalog and designate surface resource deposits are ongoing, and all aggressive wildlife in the area surrounding the initial landing site have been pacified. We are now ready to begin mass uh, production of additional time bot population units. Excellent. Great day. Fantastic. All right, so let's go over here. We are, I guess. We lack the technology. We lack the technology to re uh, required, so we can't do anything, I guess, until this actually finishes. Supposedly. Uh, ooh, hello, technology. New research. All right, what are we gonna do here? Oh, network junction. What does this do? This powerful transceiver increases the bandwidth of the signals being continuously sent between the many different systems operating across our network. Produces four unity and does two. Okay, planet unique. That's actually, I don't know if that's, it that seems pretty good. Empire leader capacity, that's good too, because I would like to try to get better scientists. Naval capacity, we probably should look at doing this sooner rather than later. Um, hmm. Not sure what does this give you though. I mean, it gives more unity, which I guess is good. Uh, getting to our to these things a little quicker, I would imagine, would be nice. For the purpose of colonizing and building frontier outposts, systems count as being half the regular distance. I mean, overall, I think that might be uh, might be a thing. Uh, we need society research. Yes. Um, maybe get the naval capacity. I know my last playthrough we got wiped out pretty handily, and I'd like to try to, to get our fleet up and running a lot quicker than previously. I mean, we're not hurting for leaders, and I'm not entirely sure what this would do except for the unity increase. No, I think I'm just going to go with naval capacity. I think it'll be good to start building that up a lot sooner so that we're not caught off guard. Because I'm sure we're not going to be well liked in... Um, the galaxy here. All right, so we finished this. Let's have the science ship come over here. Survey that system. Construction ship is working on building that up. That's fine. You, yeah, we'd like to get you hooked up, but I don't know. I'd like, I'd prefer more. Um... Wait, are you doing this? Yeah, you're building that up. Don't get us two more. We're making pretty decent uh, minerals. What we really need right now are um, credits. Although a lot of this is coming from the colonization cost. Yeah. So I don't want to add any more cost to that until our colony is finished. 
we can certainly start you know working through a couple of different things all right so that's finished here this pop is done we are running a negative balance lovely uh what do we need here um I mean, work start working on research that is probably going to be a needed thing i'd imagine um let's go ahead and take care of this we'll, we'll build a uh, society pop on here actually no let's get the uh, engineering uh build uplink node what does this do again uh uplink node an uplink made that decreases planetary latency okay does it, what does this do just produces more unity all right we'll probably want that on at some point um i may eventually put it in this this food slot here because that has nothing really needed uh but let's go ahead and build a pop here and we will I guess start with a science lab and then we drained our minerals Ugh, not fun not fun at all um, construction ship what do we want you to do well, we got a plus two here I want to see hopefully we get more from this system survey complete no <laughs> uh, all right let's go over here since it is now in our area construction ship i guess i may just have you hold for right now i mean yeah let's let's get something set up over here build mining station we'll get one of those set up and uh move on from there meanwhile our armada is going a little bit slow here oh right let's get the solar panel network that will help with uh, offsetting some of the cost of this station um, so we'll get that set up. Do we want... We should probably build a couple more Corvettes. I don't think we've gotten anything in terms of... I mean, we're researching armor right now, but I don't think we're getting anywhere... Anything else from that. We should probably try and kick out a couple more ships. So let's do that. Uh, leaders gained a level. What are you? Oh, you're... That's just the, um... The science ship. Alright, you finished here. Go ahead and set this up as well. And then afterwards, go ahead and build that. That should be okay. I do am going to get another Corvette going. Try to get that situated. I don't want to sit on too many resources. I want to try to get to our cap and, you know, go from there. We do have this additional planet within our, our territory here. Um, but I, I may not go for it. It has some, if I remember correctly, it does have some giant stuff on here. So it's, the habitability is not a big deal. Technological acquisition uh, it only has stuff. four. Oh, that's, that's just showing a really nice plot of land there, which honestly is not too bad. Once we finish this one, um, Septum Prime, we're going to go ahead and colonize over here. Society research is done. Uh, do we even need that tile blocker? No, not there. What about over here? It would help over here. So we might want to take this. What else do we got here? Uh, service umbilicals. Ship upkeep minus 10%. Um, again, if we're going heavy military, these are pretty good. I mean, army upkeep's not you know not necessarily needed at this moment um i mean eventually we will need to get armies and uh, attack and so on and so forth but just having defensive measures um a fleet is really all that i'm looking for at this time uh, so i think i will clear the blocker because that will help on um our new colony over here all right uh we are quickly increasing our mineral intake which is fantastic Science ship has finished. Nothing there, sadly. Survey that system and survey here. 
And I guess that's... I think we've just done every other one here. All right, we've established our colony. Fantastic. You are going to... Of course, at least five pops. Of course. Go ahead and build one on here. There we go. Uh, colony, main colony here. That's been built. Excellent. Let's go ahead and get the bio lab started. Um, wait, take that back. Cancel. Yes. Because I want the, um, the engineering research, the engineering lab. So we're not gonna hold. We're gonna hold off on upgrading that for just yet. Uh, what else can we? We need to build another pop here. We're gonna need more energy, so I'm tempted to do this. Although this would be a nicer one. So let's clear that, and once that's finished, we'll start building a pop. Actually, let's start building a pop right now, <clears throat> and then we'll move him over there once that energy has been has been used up. Alright, Septum, you are... Can we rename you? I don't like that name. Um, well, what we'll probably do in between episodes is I'm going to rename our system over here. So if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments below. I may actually just start naming them after um, people who have submitted their, their names for inclusion in games. So if you want your name included, uh, please comment below. If you've already done so in a previous series... Of any game, Anomalous you are on the list, so we'll get to that later. Uh, okay, change scientists. New. We're going to go ahead and research this, I think. This is a pr pretty decent one over here. In fact, you might actually be very well. Um, what are you doing? Oh, shoot. Whoops. Uh, research. And then research this. Construction ship. That's who I wanted. Come over here and build me a mining station. I'm curious to see what this gets us. Hopefully it's a pretty good sized uh, resource. Let's see. Uh, plus two. Thorough scans have revealed the cause of odd metal composition. The planet is crash site of a dozen massive starships. Spaceships. Larger than anything we could have imagined. Their construction dates back to several million years. Lovely. Alright, well that makes it a three, which is pretty good. We're going to go ahead and build that up right away. Get that in our stuff. And we are done with that. I think what I'm going to do is I am going to queue up... We don't have enough minerals just yet for another colony ship. Planetary alert. Expunge. Has developed new skills. Ooh, what did you develop? Can me can you show me? Now has the analytical trait. What does that give you? Engineering output. Woo. Wow. Um, can we move you? <laughs> uh, is this our? Ro yes, I th think. Who was that? That was that was I think our leader. I don't know if I can reassign him. Founder species time. Okay, where can I see this here? Uh, advisor, new demographics, bulky. All right, where I'm missing this. Machine intelligence, roller traits. Governor Crusher. Okay, so you're a governor. So over here? Yes. Uh, change. Oh, wait. You know what? Never mind. He's not a scientist. I don't know what the heck I was doing there. <laughs> So yeah, we uh, he's actually pretty good now. I mean, he's doubling, he's 10%, 10% um, output for all sciencing on this planet. Which, unfortunately, we don't have the greatest, you know, science stuff. So if we find a science-y kind of planet, that would be good to move him to. But for right now, I think we're okay. 
All right, let's let this build up a little bit more. All right, let's start a another colony ship. Spaceport and colony ship. It's going to drain our minerals, um, but overall we should be okay. If I could get this set up, I think I'll be happy. I mean, it's going to be kind of bad with the high gravity. I mean, we're going to take 10% more cost associated with these things. Um, but it does seem to be a pretty decent location in terms of energy. You got energy there, here, here, and there. Got a good uh, mineral deposit right there. And we haven't seen anything, you know, nearby. I guess up here. Um, and we can settle places. So, you know what? Why don't you do this survey first? And we have an unidentified empire over here. Well, let's um, let's pop over there. See if we can see. See what we can see with that. I'm curious. All right, so we're gonna take a look at that area here. Thought we had another one of those somewhere. If you do that, go here and survey this. Uh, construction ship, you are setting that up, which is, I guess, okay. You're going to take care of this. Uh, we have encountered some form of alien vessels in the... Okay, alpha aliens, we should progress with researching them. We have encountered advanced alien life form. Contact seems inevitable. All right, well, we know where that is. That's over here. My guess is, yeah, this is an actual group of people, so that is going to be interesting. Um, let's go to research, special projects. Let's go ahead and research that. We'll put the uh, current project on hold while we take care of that. You can come home. That is good. And Timetron, you are going to build, after the colony ship, go ahead and build me some Corvettes. Another Corvette. You are going to need a spaceport. We don't have the minerals yet. We're going to have to make sure to get the mineral of uh, the spaceport going there. Right, what are you doing now? You're building that. That's okay. Are you... Where's this planet? I would like for you to actually start with this. Survey. Then survey system, and then come down and survey, I guess, this. And that should be okay. Um, after successfully translating their language, we have established communication with the Von Aachen hierarchy. Diplomatic channels are now open, and all hostilities have been terminated. Lovely. Alrighty. Um, Alright, Dave interesting looking things slaving despots <laughs> uh they don't like people authoritarian all right this is not good i don't think we're gonna be friends with them alien creatures i speak on behalf of the grand marshal utunik farkifertida the undisputed ruler of the von Aachen, Aachen hierarchy respect our borders and keep out of the affairs and perhaps our mighty fleets will refrain from visiting you are, are you I don't think they're um, a fallen empire. I, I had this in my last playthrough where I wasn't paying attention. And I got like steamrolled by a fallen empire. Our, th our theoretical models have long suggested the existence of other intelligent in either galaxy, the theory, okay. Yep, excellent. Uh, this option, time on Argonaut, machine intelligence, government authority. This data must be analyzed. I think I now, nope. <laughs> thought that opened up something there, but it didn't. All right, well, we're going to probably have to put a cut in the video here um, and worry about this next time. Construction complete. I am curious to see this planet, though, so we're going to hold off until we can see that. We do have some traditions available. Uh, for the purpose of colonizing and building frontier outposts, systems count as being half the regular distance away. Oh, that's really nice. So it would save us, save us some influence, right? Yeah. Or capital buildings now produce one additional unity. Now I think we're going to go with this. 
because that would mean I should be able to colonize this place for maybe not. All right, I'm not entirely sure what that meant. For the purpose of colonizing and building frontier out frontier outposts, systems count as being half the regular distance away. Hmm. That's not what I thought would happen. I guess like, oh, hello. Asteroid impacts, habitability, minerals, plus, okay. Well, we're taking this one instead of the other one. Um, pretty good setup here. It's producing, you know, 5% better minerals. We don't really care about the habitability because we are robots. So I think that's what we're going to do. Although we don't have the, the thing. So that'll be a good, good kickstart to get us up in this area. Anomaly. Scanning a star, small objects, rapid. It's small size and high velocity make it difficult for our sensors to isolate. Um, ooh, 20%. Hmm. That... We may leave that for now and come back, maybe after he finishes this research. Maybe he'll level up and that'll come down. But we're going to go ahead and put a cut in the video. So thanks everyone for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. If you are, let me know by hitting that like button. And if you want to see more content, I strongly urge you to subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, we'll see you next time, folks. Bye-bye.